One girl in Gaza, three strikes and she's dead. Never in the past we had such a clear-cut war of good versus evil. The first attack took her parents and her siblings. The second, her leg. She spoke during the seven-day pause in November before the final fatal strike. When they shelled us with the second missile, I woke up and was surrounded by rubble. I realized my leg was gone because there was lots of blood and I couldn't move it. Her name was Dunya Abu Masen. The 13-year-old had been hoping to leave Gaza to get a prosthetic. I wish somebody would take me abroad, anywhere, just to fix my leg and be able to walk like a normal person. But she never made it out. She was killed last night in this attack when an Israeli tank shell hit NASA hospital in Khan Yunus, southern Gaza, filling the packed hallways with smoke and chaos. She had dreams of one day working in a hospital here. Instead, she was killed in one.